it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do a reading for Libra this is for Libra Sun Moon Rising and Venus and this is for the next seven days okay so we're just gonna see what comes up what do we have for Libra what do we have for Libra oh, we got one that flipped over hmm kangaroo unsettled times need to plan ahead so there's some unsettled times here oh we got two more pale time to get out of a situation you may have to clean up a mess Bowl, plenty of material things. You're gonna have plenty of material things. You don't have to worry about that. You know, I just, I wanted to look on the bottom for some reason. So I'm gonna show you what's on the bottom. Rose, romance is in the air. Romance is in the air. You need to get out of a situation. It's time to make some plans. You may be going through some unsettled times. You have plenty of things. There's nothing to worry. You don't have to worry about money or things or anything like that. What do we have for Libra? Mmm doesn't want responsibility you could be dealing with somebody that doesn't want responsibility maybe you don't want responsibility I don't know. what else do we have for Libra we got this one. Ooh, hit and run hit and run so I don't know if you know what a hit and run can mean several different things this can be a one night stand it can be a you know a hit and run in uh, that kind of manner it can also be an accident. It can be. Um, this could be getting hit and run, you know, a hit, uh, some sort of hit and run. You hit, use that however you see fit, but hit and run. Somebody doesn't want responsibility. Ooh, liar, liar. So you're dealing with a liar Taurus got this as well so you, I don't know if you're you're dealing with a Taurus a hurricane season ahead so this is like a tower moment right so there's it's something to do with the foundation that's probably not stable that's not solid it's on shaky ground um, that reminds me of a tower moment get prepared there's stormy weather ahead okay uh, I just cut the deck to unexpected help is arriving that's a star it's a shooting star so there is some sort of unexpected help arriving um, mm -hmm. interesting ooh ooh <laughs> I just cut the deck again I got the ace of pentacles and the lovers card so unexpected choice in love um, new opportunity, new investment. This is a uh, something you can touch. This is something you can hold. Something you can take to the bank, or this may have to do with a bank. This is uh, money. It's security. It's stability. But there's also some sort of connection here. Could be a sexual connection. Could be a soulmate connection. This is an unexpected choice in love. I feel like you have a golden opportunity here to go down a new path. This is a gift, it is a blessing. So you may be having to make a choice because this is a choice. When you have to make a choice, there's obviously more than one option. So you are going to have to be making a choice. There is a choice or somebody that you're dealing with is making a choice. Has to do with stability, has to do with something real, something solid, something stable. I feel like you, this, you're receiving a gift or a blessing with that ace of uh, pentacles this is a new investor some of you may be investing in something maybe it's a new partnership a new union or somebody that you're dealing with is it could be somebody that you're dealing with that is making a choice 
we're dealing with a Gemini. Taurus. Oh, we also have Sagittarius here. We have Temperance that came out. Now, Temperance is a card of patience, evolution, accepting, going with the flow. You're going to need to go with the flow. This is a uh, cooperate to bring balance to your life. So I feel like there's some obviously a change because this is a change. It's something lesser for something better. I feel like you're going to be getting something better than you expected. I feel like it's a time of change and you're probably going to need to manage your feelings because this the temperance comes after death. So there's something that has ended in accepting and allowing that everything happens for a reason. It's interesting because before I started this reading, the camera was off and I was said to myself, everything happens for a reason right before I turned it on. Everything, then this is a reason. This is a purpose. This is a card of reason and it is a card of purpose. Something has ended for a reason. You are about to receive something even better. Something solid, something real, something stable. Long term. I mean, that Ace of Pentacles is long term. It leads to stability. It's something you can hold on to. Financial security, financial stability. So you're receiving something. And I feel like it's time because this temperance card is also a card of divine timing. Queen of Cups. In the past. Justice reversed in the future. Ten of Swords. Six of Pentacles underneath the Queen of Cups. It's in the past. Ace of Wands. New exciting opportunity right in your future. So... If you've been suffering, you've been in some sort of pain, it's over. We go from the Ten of Swords to the Ace of Wands. It's the end of suffering, okay? There's been an injustice. There's been some unfair treatment. Uh, somebody was definitely lying. I don't know if you're dealing with a Sagittarius. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, you could also be dealing with another Libra. There's, there's something that may not have went in your favor. You know, we could have a contract, a karmic contract that has ended. There's been some sort of betrayal. Feels like it's with a water sign. Anyway, let's get the rest of the cards. Five of Wands. Tower Reverse. This is a permanent loss. Queen of Swords. Okay, let's talk about your person real quick. You obviously have two options. Knight of Wands reversed. That's your hit and run. Three of Cups reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. And Ten of Wands. I feel like whoever you're dealing with um, is not very... has no staying power. This person has no staying power. They are not looking for love or they're not emotionally available. Or there could be another woman. There could be another woman that is involved. Um, you, you see this Queen of Swords. I feel like that's your energy. That's two options. Okay, see she has two swords in her hand instead of one. Typically the Queen of Swords only has one. And this deck, she has two. So that's two options. I know that there's two options here. I feel like you are going to be making a decision Maybe you haven't been honest with yourself about somebody or about something. I feel like you've been deceived. You've been hurt really, really badly. Somebody may have been mingling with somebody else or they may have gotten together with somebody else and it's hard to accept. I feel like you're going to be accepting a change. I feel like... Uh, I feel like you're also going to be... Uh, dealing with some competition somebody may be competing there's some sort of competition you know talking behind your back somebody's gossiping there's got somebody's talking behind your back we get the five of wands behind the queen of swords you may have some haters you know you may have some stiff competition my ears ringing that's a clarification that my ear just started ringing so you got people, and I'm starting to get chills. I'm starting to get goosebumps. So you definitely have some haters. You got people that are jealous of you. It's like they want what you have. 
I don't know. I feel like you got, especially a water sign. So water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, there's, or it could be a Sagittarius. There is somebody that is extremely jealous of what you have. They're going to be picking a fight with you. Somebody is going to pick a fight with you. This is somebody that uh, is your competition. Somebody is competing with you. The middle card where you are right now is the Ten of Swords. That's 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 pain. Okay, that's suffering. That's sadness. It's despair. It's uh, suffering. So you may be you may be in some sort of pain right now over a loss. Underneath that you know to the right is the tower reversed i feel like there's been an event you know that is life changing i feel it's it's a permanent loss i don't know if there's health issues here or somebody has in underneath above the tower is the justice reversed so they're mirror they're right together they're mirroring each other they said something has not turned it could be an argument with no resolution in sight something has not turned out in your favor i don't know if it's a legal loss or it's a contract or there could even be a divorce here or a change in a living situation that has happens extremely suddenly very 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 suddenly um, somebody's about to there's some sort of karma here and getting what you deserve what goes around comes around so you know their karma works in both ways okay there's good and there's bad there's somebody in this reading that's gonna get exactly what they deserve um, and it could be in a good way it could be in a bad way there's gonna be a major upheaval there's gonna there is and it's a permanent loss with that tower reverse. I know people don't want to hear that, but the tower, you can't avoid this change. You can't avoid it. It's like you've tried to avoid it. You've tried to avoid disruption, or you've tried to avoid building a new foundation, or you've tried to avoid uh, the truth, you know, but you can't avoid the truth. You can't avoid it. You can't avoid it. So there's something that is going to happen that this is like a rude awakening it is it's a and it's gonna hurt okay so you may get some information that really brings you some clarity about somebody that you are dealing with i do feel like you are going down a new path with that ace of wands that is that's that's exciting okay that that's um a new vision a new drive a new desire you may even have a new a new partner here it could be a new sexual partner you know that uh happens very suddenly i feel like there's definitely sudden change ace of wands next to the tower reverse you never saw it coming um i also feel like you have a very big-hearted individual here that you i don't know this person has something to give you they can give you something solid they can give you something real i feel like it's it's somebody that uh, i don't know if you've been reluctant to give them a chance i don't know if you've been hoping for a reconciliation with somebody from your past there is somebody here that is very caring that is very kind that uh can help you to heal this is a healer of some sort this person um, can help you. They're gonna. Op they have something to offer you. You know. I feel like you. You need to choose wisely. You need to use your head and your heart. And I feel like. I feel like what you've been doing is. I feel like you've been playing with a player. You've been waiting for this player who's hurt you so bad or is hurting you right now to. Uh, come clean, but this person isn't going to come clean. You could be dealing with somebody that has no staying power, that acts recklessly, that makes impulsive moves, that, you know, cheats. It feels like you're dealing with a cheater. I feel like you're dealing with somebody that, you know, is more, listens to their friends, gossips a lot, um, isn't really interested in love is interested in sex but not love isn't they may be in a in a situation that is loveless but they're looking for i don't know if it's friends with benefits or sex on the side or something like that um ten of wands ten of wands over there in your person that's overwhelmed too many responsibilities busy 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 and this person is busy we got some whoever you're dealing with is is has reached a point i feel of exhaustion as well i feel like i don't know if you're dealing with somebody that even has a drinking problem three of cups reversed and the ace of cups reversed that could be emotions all over the place self-medicating um under some sort of social pressure as well i feel like 
I feel like we have somebody here that is has reached a point where they have no desire to uh, open their heart you know they're not this is emotional this is emotional shutdown this is it is with the ace of cups reverse this person may be a player i feel like you're dealing with somebody who needs attention that needs constant attention this person acts inappropriately you know they act impulsively this person is trying to prove i don't know what they're trying to prove but they're trying to prove something you could be dealing with somebody that is angry, that doesn't think before they act, you know, and they just like all the attention that they get. Three of Cups reversed. That's parting ways, parting ways from friends, family, relationships. There's definitely gossip here. There's gossip. There's, there's somebody here that talks a lot, they, and it feels like this per person is... I don't know. I feel like they're angry. I feel like they may have some anger issues, you know? Emotionally, emotions all over the place. You're dealing with somebody that... I feel like this person is exhausted, but they're trying to prove that they're not, but they are. There could be a sudden departure here with the King of, Knight of Wands reversed. I don't know if there's drinking and driving. You know, somebody may... Uh, there may have something to do with drinking and driving and, you know, out of control energy. There's with that Knight of Wands reverse. That's out of control. I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is very boastful. This person has a big ego. They need constant attention and they may, oh, it's called negative attention, doing anything to get attention. So you're dealing with somebody that's doing anything to get attention. It feels like it's an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I don't know. Emotions, all, drowning in emotions, overwhelmed, trying to do too much, going overboard, acting inappropriately. Maybe on social media. Somebody may be doing something inappropriate on social media. I don't know whose message that is. Anyhow, there's gonna be there's gonna be a decision that is made. We have somebody here that needs to uh, cooperate they need to moderate themselves they need to act in moderation you know they need to balance out their feelings manage their feelings but I feel like there's a lot of suffering here there's stiff competition there's going to be an event this event, I don't know if it change, It happens in your home or it happens in a body. You know, the tower is a foundation and your body is a foundation. Your home is a foundation. Your job is a foundation. It's like it's an unavoidable change. I think it's been avoided up until now. This, this is like an explosion. Maybe it's an, I don't know, that Queen of Swords is is a new perspective is needed. Somebody needs needs a new perspective and they're about to get one. There could be news of legalities here. Things may not go in your favor. And I hate to say that, but when you get justice reversed, that's things not going in your favor. There could be an argument with no resolution in sight. There's somebody here that is really, really suffering. This is the death of a situation with the Ten of Swords. It is major disturbance something is coming to an end it's been avoided up until now we have somebody here that's i feel like they're going overboard they're in their emotions i don't know if there's addictions here and somebody is going overboard There's some sort of action that is about to be taken. Somebody's about to take action. 
there's there's action that is about to be taken. I feel like we have a, a professional that may be getting involved. Out of control energy. We got somebody here that I'm cold now that is looking for a fight. They're looking for a fight, definitely. They're picking a fight and things could get out of control. But in your future is the Ace of Wands, which is a new beginning, a new vision. Somebody's about to get a new vision. After there's some sort of injustice, because justice is reversed right behind that, you know? So I feel like, I don't know, I don't know if there's a court ruling. Somebody could end up in court, which sends them down a new path. Sometimes that's what's needed. Disruption. You may be taking the tower down for somebody. You may be, because with Queen of Swords and the tower reverse, you may be causing some upheaval. There's definitely some health problems here as well. There is. We got somebody here that has been going overboard and they need a change. They need to make a change. They do. There is going to be a change. There's going to be a need to be flexible, I think. And I don't even need the Two of Pentacles because change is coming. You don't see it coming. You don't see it coming. You don't. This, this, like I said, this has to do with the foundation. Could be your job, could be your home, could be your body. Could be somebody that you that you it could be a family member. Somebody has reached a breaking point. This is, and this could be a breakdown. It could be an emotional breakdown. It could be a, a mental breakdown. It could be a midlife crisis. This is a breakdown of some sort. Time to get out of a situation. You're dealing with somebody that doesn't want responsibility. This person lies a lot. They're emotionally unavailable. This person, uh, they can't, they can't keep up the facade anymore. It's like the facade is falling apart. Whatever the facade is, this is like weary. It's like you reached rock bottom. That's what I see. I also feel like you're you dealing with somebody that is really busy causing chaos. They like to cause chaos because it's called negative attention. You know, they 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 get themselves, you know, trying to prove points, and they cause a lot of chaos. You got somebody here that uh, is entitled. They feel like they're entitled. You know, they feel like they can do whatever they want there's gonna be a fight I know that there is there's gonna be a fight with whoever this person is or upheaval or chaos there's gonna be a sudden departure somebody is like suddenly going someplace it's like a termination termination of a friendship could be a friend it's a termination of a friendship or a termination of a relationship. It's parting ways with the Three of Cups reverse. Could be a family member. This is parting ways, suddenly. Suddenly parting ways. Can't do it anymore. Reach the end. Reach the end. Can't carry this burden. Can't carry this weight. I've reached the end. This isn't this isn't love. It's sad. And there could be some tears that are shed about this departure. You know? It's time. It's time for you to receive. It's time for you. And maybe it's time for you to receive love. 
you know, or you're, it's time for you to receive some tender, loving care. It's time for you to receive what you deserve. It's time for you to receive something better. And maybe you've been reluctant. That's why the tower is here. The tower is force. And I do see force change. I do. I, I do. I think the tower will cause upheaval to force you to change something that you have been reluctant to because of, I don't know, maybe you were hoping for a reunion or you were hoping this person would change or you were hoping that things would get better. But this is the end with the Ten of Swords. It is the end of things. This is it's over. This is a this is goodbye. It is. It's goodbye. It is. It's goodbye. So I feel like you're gonna be saying goodbye. You're dealing with somebody that is like uh, taking action. I feel like I feel like they're leaving, or you're leaving them, or something like. There's another woman here. You also have somebody that is bitching behind your back. They're gossiping. They're talking about you. And there could be several people. Jealous. You probably need to protect your energy. You may need to go in another direction. Maybe you're, you're, you're reluctant to let these people go because... I don't know, maybe you like the competition or you or you want feel the need to prove yourself to these people. I don't know. It feels like you need to walk away. Stop giving your energy to people that don't support you. Don't even respond. Don't communicate with them. Don't give them your energy. Maybe that's what. Maybe that's how you take the tower down. It's like you know what? I'm not even gonna give you a bit of anything. You don't need to respond to people just to fight. <laughs> Move yourself from the situation. Don't respond. One of these swords is down. And I got chills when I said don't respond. That means that that's turning communication off. So, you know, maybe you need to stop communicating with somebody that lies to you all the time, that, you know, that pretend, people that pretend you're, they're your friends, you know? You don't need that energy. Nine of Cups reversed next to the Ace of Wands. That's not happy. Lack of wish fulfillment. I wish I never got myself involved in this. The Nine of Cups reversed. That's, that's a lack of inner happiness, right? It's like, this is not what I asked for. It's really not. I feel like, um, I don't know if we have a, we have a disaster here. The, with, this, with the Tower reversed and the Nine of Cups reversed, even could be a social disaster. Page of Swords reversed on the bottom. A message is coming that you don't want to hear. I feel like there's an enemy I feel like you have an enemy here. An enemy. I know that you have an enemy here. This is like an enemy disguised as a friend, or there is somebody here that is very hostile. You're probably going to be caught off guard. There's a liar. We have a liar. We have a cheat. We have somebody. We may even have somebody here that has some mental health issues. Totally out of control with that Knight of Wands reverse. That is out of control. It's like dangerous. This is like a show off that is out of control that is acting recklessly. There's jealousy issues here too. Ace of Wands. That's, that's just doing it. It's just doing something. Taking action. Not happy. There's somebody around you that is really, 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 really not happy. This person is aggressive. They're going to be picking a fight. But you're in the upright. You are in the upright. You're in the upright. So I think that you will be victorious. I mean, you're, you're strong, right? You're really, really strong. 
but you need to get prepared, okay? Get prepared for some sort of fight. I think it's a massive one. I do. I also see a painful change here with that tower reverse. That's a painful change that has been avoided up until now. This isn't fair. It's not fair. You may say, I mean, the justice reverse is like it's not. What I heard was, it's not fair, it's not fair. So, something isn't fair. Something is falling apart, and it's, I feel like it's falling apart, and it's not fair. It's not fair. So, I'm not sure what is going on. I think you're dealing with somebody. I also feel like we have somebody here that is mentally imbalanced. This person is mentally imbalanced. I feel like they are picking a fight. Their emotions, that's what this main message is. Their emotions are all over the place. They're angry. But what advice? I mean, what's the turnout? What's the turnout? What's the overall outcome? Emperor reversed may have something to do with a father or somebody that is uh, it doesn't have to be a father could be a husband it has to do with a masculine energy this person is corrupt illegal dealings not very wise out of control five of cups reversed Five of Pentacles, abandonment, absent father, grieving, grieving over a loss, not accepting help, not willing to get help. We have somebody here that needs help. This person is aggressive. They are mean-spirited. They are inexperienced. They are have control issues. There is somebody here that, but, but the outcome is the Five of Pentacles, which is hardship. It's like abandonment, being abandoned, being abandoned. Somebody's, I don't know, been going to be abandoned or they have been abandoned. Beginning to realize there's another opportunity. Five of Cups reversed. A lot of regrets. We got somebody here that has a lot of regrets. They have a lot of regrets for abandoning a situation. Expect the unexpected with these fives. Life is about to change. Eight of Wands. News. Movement. Eight of Wands. So the outcome is news arriving. Things are going to speed up. Things are going to change. They're going to change really, really fast. It has to do with a masculine that is out of control. Unfortunately, this person is grieving. They're, this is like, a, I feel like it's like some sort of battle zone, honestly. I mean, I hate to say that, but on this card, I mean, if you take a look at the Eight of Wands, I mean, it looks like it's getting ready for war. I mean, doesn't it? I feel like um, there's going to be movement. I don't know. There could even be an arrest. I'm not sure if somebody's going to get arrested. These people. It feels like these people are on a mission. There could be people that are coming in. Um, they're on a mission. Maybe they're on a mission to uh, help because of that five of pentacles. It looks like we have some people that need help. Fool reverse, that's that's uh, foolish, making a foolish mistake, doing something foolish, doing something uh, without thinking. We have somebody here that is doing something without thinking. And they're going to regret it. The extreme regrets. They're really going to regret it. It feels like there's... It feels like there's some sort of legal issues. There's legal with that justice reverse. It's like there's some sort of uh, consequences. Anyhow. Um, A 
somebody is lying about their foundation as well, they're not telling the truth. They're not telling the truth. And I feel like the truth is going to come out. Okay, some the truth is going to come out. They may be lying about a commitment or they're lying about a contract or lying about a marriage or they're lying about another woman. They're lying about something. They may be saying that, you know, they're not in a contract, but they are. It's, this could just be sex without love. The Ace of Wands and the Nine of Cups reversed right together. I mean, this could definitely be, somebody may be having sex with somebody without love. Not looking for love, not looking for, you know, I don't see anything about a relationship here. Nothing. I do feel like there is somebody here that can give you love, but I think that you're focused on somebody that isn't. Anyhow. Um, I do believe that there's going to be some increased messages going back and forth between you and another person who may be realizing, maybe you're realizing it or they're realizing it. Somebody is going to be increasing their messages with somebody else after they have been grieving so long over a masculine that deserted them. We have a masculine that deserted somebody, that abandoned somebody, and there's been some prolonged grief. Now there's going to be some fast forward movement and, uh, communication okay it's not going to be i don't think it's going to be with a masculine that deserted you i mean it could be could be page of cups reversed nope i don't think it is i think it's not going to be with that person it's probably going to be with somebody else queen of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn somebody solid somebody stable solid real you're going to be increasing your communication with somebody that is Obviously, this person looks to be loyal, the little dog. This is a time of fertility. Somebody that is financially stable. There's going to be increased communication with somebody that has something. There's that Ace of Pentacles. She's got the Ace of Pentacles. There's going to be increased communication with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It feels like this person can help you. They can help you to uh, focus on the future. Good luck.